Police are investigating an attempted murder today on Oahu's west side after a man was injured in an early morning shooting. Cat TV 4's Kristen Concilio joins us live at the scene of the crime with tonight's top story. That's right, Mika and Jai, another day, another shooting, this time on Ho'okele Street in Maili. Some residents here on Ho'okele Street are afraid to even talk about gun violence. That's because they just experienced a shooting firsthand. It's happening around everybody's neighborhoods. You never, you never know. Like, that's how bad it is now. You can step out of your house and get shot at. Like, it's terrible. Police responded shortly after reports of gunfire. Witnesses say four people drove up in a black faded Dodge Charger. A gunman with his face mask got out and started shooting, leaving one man injured. This is on the night of Halloween for something like this to happen in its community. Folks are scared. There's several bullet holes in this white Tacoma pickup truck, but so far no suspect in the case. It's very unsafe for us. You know, we do have family, we do have friends. Um, children, you know, it's scary. It's scary for us now. Um, the shootings, it's happening. It's happening. It's like there's a shooting every single week. Just days ago, community members and their children rallied here to stop gun violence. If this continues, that we need to start closing off these places where crime is happening, starting with our public beaches and parks, where folks cannot go into these areas. Folks need to be at home at certain times. And until we can get these things under control, that we need help. Ho'okele Street was shut down for hours as police investigated the attempted murder. We talked to family members of the victim, but they wanted to be blurred out because it's just too dangerous with the shooter or shooters still on the loose. And it's Hawaii. Come on now. It's like it's not even the mainland. It's coming bad and it needs to stop.